गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल सी ए लाइव प्रोसीजर ऑफ पर कोटेनियस टेस्टोमी बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग टू प्रोसीजर आई एल इंट्रोड्यूस विद इट्स इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स सो दिस इज पोटेक्स टेकेस्टोमी टू वी आर गोइंग टू यूज सो वी विल ओपन इट्स सेट एंड सी वॉट इज देयर इन साइट सो दिस इज होल असेंबली इट इज हैविंग सिरिंज एंड दिस इज 14 gauge needle can you see this 14 gauge needle and this is sheath so needle is going inside this sheath and just tip is coming out can you see this needle tip is coming out from sheath so this whole assembly will pierce intertracheal space this is guide wire can you see guide wire this is helping introduce guide wire to sheath so once you insert the sheath you have to insert guide wire like this so after inserting it it takes j shaped this guide wire take j shaped j shaped why because it should not hit directly to posterior wall of trachea so it won't cause injury to posterior wall of trachea that's why it is j shaped this is short dilator its size is 14 french so after inserting sheath we are coming out and we are leaving guide wire it is used for to dilate intertracheal space so this is guiding catheter you can see at the one end it has some bulging can you see this bulging so once you are going inside that intertracheal space this up to this only this segment so this bulge is marker how much we have to go inside so this portion it should go inside the trachea and this rest will stay outside this is self lubricated dilator so you can see this mark this black mark so we have to insert this dilator up to this marks like this from upward to downwards up to this marks so you can see this size is 12.7 mm so we have to take incision at least 12.7 mm at the site of intertracheal space so this is the castrum tube and this is introducer so we will insert in the tracheostom tube and we have to go upward to downward once we will insert this tracheostom tube we will remove this introducer after that we will push air inside this balloon so by that this balloon will uh, inflate and fix tracheostom tube inside the trachea so this is all about its instruments now let's see live procedure so before proceeding to procedure we will see anatomy of our trachea so this is trachea most prominent part on trachea is thyroid cartilage below that cricoid cartilage after that first ring felt is first tracheal ring then second tracheal ring third tracheal ring fourth tracheal ring and so on this is suprasternal notch so below first tracheal ring is space 1 then below 2 is space 2 below 3 is space 3 so we have to do tracheostomy in 2 or 3 we should not go extreme lower side because if we go extreme lower side we will injure brachiocephalic trunk so we should go at least above 1.5 finger breadth above external notch we should not go extreme higher like first ring or above because there is high chance of subglottic stenosis so ideal site is second intertracheal space or third intertracheal space so before starting tracheostomy procedure we have to adjust our existing endotracheal tube 
सो यू कैन एडजस्ट इन गाइडेंस ऑफ ब्रोंकोस्कोपी और जस्ट पुल ब्लाइंडली टू टू थ्री सेंटीमीटर जस्ट मेक श्योर दैट कफ ऑफ एंडोट्रिकल ट्यूब शुड बी जस्ट बिलो वोकल कॉर्ड्स सो दिस इज अवर पेशेंट इन होम वी आर गोइंग टू डू पर कोटनिस ट्रैकेस्टोमी सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग प्रोसीजर वी हैव टू स्टलाइज अवर द ट्रैकेस्टोमी एरिया विथ नाइन्टी परसेंट एल्कोहल दैट इज स्प्रिट बिटाडिन देन अगेन स्प्रिट सो दिस इज स्प्रिट वी आर क्लीनिंग विथ एंड नाउ वी आर क्लीनिंग विथ टेन परसेंट प्रोविडोन आयोडीन and we have to clean up to shoulders and above side chin so we have to take care of sterility because it will help to prevent ventilator associated pneumonia so this is our final cleaning by 90 95% alcohol that is spirit and we will wait till it get uh, dry now we will take green sheet that is sterile sheet to cover the area just we will expose the area where we are going to insert our tracheostomy this is thyroid cartilage this is cricoid this is first and this is second space so this is our space where we are going to insert our tracheostomy now we will take local with 1% xylocaine mixed with adrenaline first we will insert needle and check See, air is coming. So this is our site of tracheostomy. Now we will infiltrate skin, subcutaneous tissue, muscle, and finally uh, trachea. So this is our local. So now we will give incision. This one point two to one point five centimeter. This is horizontal. We have to give uh, skin incision only. No need to give through and through. now we will take our assembly syringe needle and sheath we will insert up to that give way feeling and air comes you can see this air is coming so this is confirmation of our site guide wire and we have to insert toward downwards so we have kept our needle bevel like that guide wire should go downwards only so you can see white mark so now we will remove that sheath now we will insert short dilator i told you this is 14 french so we will dilate skin subcutaneous tissue muscle tracheal sheet and we will insert in trachea so This is very helpful. We have to go in rot rotatory manner by pressing. So after that, we will take our guiding sheath. I told you that arrow is there. In that direction, we have to insert toward downwards. That bulging up to that bulging. So after that, we will insert that pre-lubricated this dilator, this conical shape. Sometimes we have to give very force. in that patient that uh, who have strong muscles if uh, sometime we have to give incision also that incision we have given initially was not sufficient so we are giving incision little more so sometime we have to give a small incision only skin incision then we will press very hard because this patient is quite young so muscle is very strong so now our uh, that uh, dilator has inserted up to that mark yeah can you see that black mark now we will remove dilator only so now we will insert our uh, tracheostomy with transducer so we have applied lignocaine jelly on tracheostomy tube we have to rotate and we have to insert after inserting we have to remove all things which were inside including transducer so little blood can come no problem so we will attach ventilator and we will inflate this balloon now we will check 
whether the tracheostomy tube is correct position or not. So we will auscultate both side whether chest air entry is equal or not. We will see in ventilator also whether graph is coming or not. See beautiful scalar is coming. We can see tidal volume also is normal. So now we will tie our tracheostomy tube. So first we will take gauze piece with betadine and wrap around the tracheostomy tube. So this is steps which is coming in kit only. So we will tie both side around the neck. So there is no need to give sutures. This is sufficient. So this is our procedure has completed. So friends, did you like this procedure? If you really like it, please write in comment box and share with your friends. If you are not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe it. See you again with new video. Thank you very much.